Welcome back to ET Race. This is week 87, 86, 87. Uh, 87, yes. Day three. Um, on the defense, we got another failure, but uh, no points lost. So, no problem. So, this team is pretty odd team. We have Larcy. Plus one, plus five, swap, speed plus three. Bonus unit is wrist, plus one. Uh, C dual infantry, okay. Dazzling staff, close guard, restore plus. Force it, a plus three force it with Gale Force, bow fighter. Join home defense and death rest. So they went in all in on this forces. Then we got Mila with Fury and Bonfire. And finally Peony with a plus one plus five with Wings of Mercy, Distant Guard, and Moonbomb. So yeah, Forsyth as the carry. That's not something you see every day. Oh, and we got another tactics room holding down my Bernadetta again. So, yay for that. And a level 7 catapult that took out our healing tower. Not our healing tower, our dark shrine and panic manor. Alright. Take some damage, but they have a healer, so good dreams are born. Like the only problem with like the restore staff is just that does not heal very much. But it's still pretty convenient to be able to uh just move forward with it. Sergo Sotis manages to do one point of damage. Yeah. Then everybody just moves forward. Huh. Yeah, he's able to gale force, but Pleasant Dreams. Straight into a trap. Heals our Erica. Heals Peony. And then, yeah, you know what's gonna happen right now. Bernadetta just obliterates that poor Peony. And then Lilina takes out Mila. So that's how they lose both their units. Renee goes after Larcy, but that's about it. Take a Burning, Gale Force, take a Lilina. Renea. Gets hit with Ragnarastra and yeah. So here is something really interesting though. Huh? Unit hits him for 29, which leaves him with exactly 29 health. But because Force of Lance heals him, he's able to survive that. So yeah, that's pretty cool. So they cannot afford to leave Yune alive because she will destroy that Larcy. I mean that um, force it next turn. So they cannot take the ether. So they go down minus one ether, minus two units. All right. So today's battle. 
What do we have today? We have a Thanax with an Elewood. Okay, so we got Kichita. Elewood, which is gonna be annoying because of the Dragon Slaying ability. But let's go in order. Plus one Aversa. Uh, HP plus five, Renewal. Drawback. Sairi. Reposition, Swift Sparrow. Sothes. Attack Feint, okay. With a Rally. Ninian, just attack tactics and fortified defense too. There's that Elliwood again. Uh, rally attack death, Mumbo, heavy blade, speed opening, okay. And Kichira with a rally, Mumbo, sturdy blob. So this definitely looks like a Fjord map. Like, there's a lot of red units here. And Elliwood kind of makes me not want to bring uh, Grima just because of his effectiveness to her. So they are... I can send on my... Well, let's see what units have come with Fjorm. That is... So I could send the three of you air... Peony and um, Silk up the left side to get the ether. And I can just plop Fjorm right here with Lucina support. And have them go up this way just to get the ethers. Like, destroy this, destroy this, destroy the ether. Can even spend about two turns doing that and just like stay out of the way of this ball tower. Though it doesn't do much damage either. Future is not written. So this will actually be the, the first true test for my brand new Fjorm because yesterday's match was definitely not a test to her power. that we got silk yes oh what's next hold on i did not want to move that so yeah um ready yeah we can get silk to go up to the ether one two three spots okay uh, so maybe. Alright, so we'll just wait it out one last turn for the ball tower. That way I don't have to deal with the damage because Kitshira does have effective against. Ready. Alright, we take the 15 points of damage. Or we took the 50 points of damage already. As you say. All right, so here we go. Orders, please. Could you hear? Good morning. Dance you. Pleasant dreams. All right, so one of you two cannot reach over here because you don't have guidance or anything like that. Yes. So we can easily go over here.
If I go over here, everybody will reach. So I do not want to go there. Understood. And yep, you cannot reach, which means you can get dance. What's next? Looking forward to it. Uh, okay, we can Death's destroy this. Caress. So here we go. There's the stupid rallies. There's a lot of rallies in this team. I do forgot. I do want to be careful with that because I don't want to time out. Alright, here comes Elliewood. Yeah, I get hit by Bigness. Sawtooth gets one shot as well. Okay. As you say. So we can one shot Sairi. Yes. And take out a Versa. Who needs assistance? And get the Ether all in one turn. You out. Choices, and, get the choices. and we know that's not even the real trap, so let's just go take a mini. Uh, I guess we can out. And that's it. Another fairly easy map. Yeah, this was another fairly easy fight. What do we got? We are tier 23 at the moment. I mean, 23 or 24. Now tier 23 at the moment. Just outside of it. But yeah, uh, so far another easy match for this week. I uh, don't think we have anything to summon on today. Nope, not in someone yet. So yeah, um, another day, um, another easy fight. So far our defense team seems to be holding. I mean, we have not lost full points on any of the matches. We managed to at least kill one for every match. Alright, uh, with all that being said, I thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye.